Al-Qaeda in the Arabian Peninsula announced the killing of its leader Khalid bin Omar Batrafi. The organization said it chose Saad bin Atif al-Awakli, nicknamed Abu Layth, as the new leader of the organization. This report has more details. Al-Qaeda militant group has announced that the leader of its Yemen branch, Khalid al-Batrafi, has died. The U.S. government has placed a $5 million bounty on his head over leading Al-Qaeda in the Arabian Peninsula, or AQAP. In a video released by Al-Qaeda on Sunday, Al-Batarfi's deceased body was wrapped in a funeral shroud of Al-Qaeda's black and white flag. The group offered no details on the cause of his death, adding that the 40-something-year-old man would be succeeded by Saad bin Atif al-Awkali as the leader. Al-Batarfi took over as the head of the branch in February 2020 after Qasim Arimi was killed by a drone strike ordered by then-President Donald Trump. AQAP, formed by the merging of Al-Qaeda's Yemen and Saudi branches, has launched assaults against both rebel and government targets in Yemen as well as foreigners. AQAP and other ISIS-aligned terror groups have prospered during Yemen's nine-year civil conflict. Al-Batarfi was one of 150 arrested AQAP militants who were released after the organization seized the Yemeni coastal city of Mukalla in 2015. AQAP was eventually forced out of Mukalla, but continued to strike. Following Al-Qaeda's attempt to attack a commercial plane over the U.S. in 2009, Washington regarded the group as Al-Qaeda's most dangerous affiliate. While its overseas operations have waned in recent years, AQAP remains the most effective terrorist group in Yemen, with intent to conduct operations in the region and beyond, according to the UN. The UN estimates that AQAP has three to 4,000 active fighters and passive members. The organization raises money by robbing banks and money exchange shops, smuggling weapons and counterfeiting currencies.